on YouTube fam bam it's your girl Des with Des Crazy Life and I am back with another video y'all your girl is doing fine um, I wanted to give you guys an update a quick update um, I am wearing a heart monitor for the next two weeks so I probably only got like eight days left to wear it and um, I am taking it easy, you guys, and trying to do everything that I need to do, do my due diligence to take care of myself and make sure that I am good to go so that I can return back to work. Um, excuse the noise in the background. The Hubbiton is putting some air in one of the tires. Um, we have some exciting news, but this is this is something that I'm going to do next month. I'm going to start looking at things next month. And I'm talking in code because I don't want anyone to know what I'm doing. Some of my friends know, my close friends know, and um, my favorite cousins know. But I am planning something big for our family. And um, next month, I'm actually going to the place where everything is going to just start. So um, we are gonna have a major, major life change coming up very, very, very soon. So I'm looking at probably in six months, this channel is gonna be very different. <laughs> I'll still be recording my shenanigans and all that good stuff, but my entire lifestyle is about to change. And um, it's for the better because, I don't know, now that I'm middle-aged and I'm on the decline of my dash, because you know, you're born and then you die and you have that dash in the middle. Well, now I'm on the down end of that dash in the middle and I want to make the most of it and um, yeah so this is a very quick video you guys but I wanted to let you guys know what is going on and um, in a way because I'm, I'm still being pretty cryptic right but um, I wanted you guys to know that I read all the comments. Thank you guys for the prayers, the well wishes, and all that good stuff. And I'm just so glad, you know, I'm 45 and I see things so different now. I see things so different from when I saw them 10 years ago, even five years ago, the way I looked at things. And there's something else going on that I am not sharing at this time, but I will share once we've accomplished the major life change event that I want to accomplish. And, um, you know, my son is doing exceptionally well in school. Um, we FaceTime every day. We talk every day, both of my boys. And my son is... Um, doing everything independently now and he has his confidence built up and he is making excellent grades and I'm just I'm so grateful to God that he is able to do everything that the school systems throughout his life told me he would never be able to do and um, y'all I just count it all joy I'm so sorry for the noise in the background, y'all. It's just awful. You know, he knows that I'm recording a video. And I was like, just hold off for a minute, baby. I'm going to record. And then, bam. <laughs> he does it anyway. But whatever. I digressify. So, thank you, thank you, thank you, you guys, for everything. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. This is Des, Crazy Life, signing off. Bye, guys. Oh, wait a minute. That was...
premature. I also want to tell you guys, I did have an SVT event. I had an SVT event um, last night and um, it's getting very annoying because last night I honestly didn't do anything that I can think of to trigger it except I ate a dessert that I've never eaten before. So now I'm not going to say what dessert that was. So now I'm just not going to eat anything that I'm unfamiliar with now because it's outrageous. So I had to take um, an extra pill. Um, it did break, but it kept coming back, right? It kept coming back because whatever it was I ingested was still in my system. So I had to take an extra pill and then like maybe an hour, um, maybe an hour and 15 minutes, I stopped it stopped trying to, um, it stopped reoccurring. So what I mean by reoccurring, so um, heart rate 180, vagal down, then it's in the 130s. Then 10 minutes later, heart rate 200, vagal down in the 140s, 120s. Then a few minutes later, heart rate shoots back into the 170s vagal down then and so forth and so on and I dealt with that for about an hour and 15 minutes until um, my metoprolol kicked in so I had to take an extra dose so um, I'm usually so careful and I tried a dessert but I looked and I didn't see anything you know, strange about it. So it didn't look like there were any stimulant ingredients, ingredients. So I went on and ate it. But um, like 20, 30 minutes later, I paid for it. So I don't know if it was the dessert or if it was just a fluke or if it just happened if it was something else that I did but I didn't do anything I didn't even work out yesterday I did absolutely nothing and y'all when I went into the SVT episodes I was sitting down I actually laid down to try to go to sleep and that surge woke me up out of my sleep and um, I had to keep vagaling down and all that good stuff. But I'm fine, you guys. And I'm sure good old Betsy Boo here caught it and recorded it. So just keep me in your prayers, you guys. And um, I'm really excited for what's ahead. And I can't wait to share with you guys what's exactly going to happen. But, um, but yeah, so I'm really excited. I'm like... Oh my gosh. Anywho, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been Dez with Dez Crazy Life signing off. Bye guys. Going for real this time. Later.